To find the equation of the line that contains the points uh, negative 5, negative 1, and negative 3, negative, use the formula y equal mx plus b. In other words, the equation I'm going to be creating is going to have this form, y equal mx plus b. And to set up the equation, I need two pieces of information. I need to find out who's my slope, the m, and who's my y-intercept, the b. So we're going to first uh, start finding the slope, m. To find m, we're going to use the slope formula. m equal y2 minus y1 over x2 minus x1. So let's start replacing each of these variables with the value. Okay, so my uh, y2 is going to be negative 8, and I'm going to subtract y1, which is negative 1. And then my x2 is going to be negative 3, and I'm going to be subtracting negative 5. Remember, by the rules of integers, okay, the rules of adding, um, subtracting integers, subtracting a number is the same thing as adding the opposite. So negative 8, take away negative 1, is the same thing as negative 8 plus 1. And negative 3 minus negative 5 is the same thing as negative 3 plus 5. And when I simplify this, I'm going to have negative 7 over 2. So in other words, my slope, my m, is negative 7 over 2. So I'm going to write here, I'm going to replace the m with the value I just found out, negative 7 over 2. So as you can see here, this equation is getting uh, the shape, it's getting in form. However, I'm missing the b. Okay, I need to find the y-intercept. And how do we find the y-intercept? Well, I'm going to use this incomplete equation because I'm missing b. And I'm going to calculate b. And how do I calculate b? Well, I'm going to replace the value of x and the value of y to calculate b. Now, with which values I'm going to replace the x and the y? Well, you're going to use one of these two points. So I'm going to use the first point, negative 5, negative 1. So that means that my x here is going to be negative 5 and my y here is going to be negative 1 and then I simplify to solve for b so when I multiply negative 7 half times negative 5 I'm going to have negative 1 equal uh, 35 over 2 plus b now to solve for b I need to subtract both sides by 35 over 2 so when I do that I'm going to have negative 1 take away 35 over 2, and all that is going to be my b. I need to convert the negative 1 into a fraction with denominator 2. So negative 1 is the same thing as negative 2 over 2. And then I can subtract now 35 over 2. And when I simplify this, I'm going to have at the end negative 37 over 2 is going to be my b. Now that I know b, I can go back up here and I can complete the equation that I have uh, unfinished. I need to replace the b with negative 37 over 2. And now I have my uh, equation that goes through the points negative 5, negative 1, and negative 3, negative 8. I hope this helps.